every year. Millions of people go online looking for love, hoping for the best, but never expecting the worst. But for our next guest, Lynn Hawes, the worst truly happened when the man she thought could be the love of her life turned out to be a con artist. Yeah, after a whirlwind romance with John, not his real name, things started to unravel and when he began asking Lynn for money, embroiling her in an international scam which saw her lose £100,000. Now, along with seven other brave people, Lynn has shared her story in the new series, Love Rats. Oh, goodness me. That's a lot of money, Lynn. And, yeah, and hearing it, it like that is just... It's really, really harsh. Now, now Lynn, talk, take us back to when you first started dating online. Was it via an app? How, how did that look for you? Yeah, I first started dating uh, through uh, a dating app and, yeah, everything was going really good. I was getting lots of dates, but not turning up. Always, always saying, sorry, I can't turn up. But this one person sort of drew me in a bit. Mm, and what, what was it about that one person that I drew just you don't... I, I can't explain it. He just... It was just so gentle and nice and... Mm -hmm. he, he enjoyed everything I enjoyed and he just... I, I don't know, there's just something special I, I, I can't explain, but something... And so, and, and how, so, so you meet on the app and normally on these things you match someone else yeah. and you, you go yeah. through your interests yeah. and I suppose conversation starts to yeah. unfold. Yeah. At what point do you meet up? How long, is, how long are conversations going back and forward for? A uh, good few weeks. We're talking for hours and hours, literally right. getting to know each other quite well, actually. I, I felt like I'd known him. Mm -hmm. For a heck of a lot longer. And is that just via message? Is it uh, text message, or is that phone calls, on the phone? All sorts, yeah. So you actually, yeah. so you actually spoke to him and heard his physical yeah, voice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you also met him. Yeah, yeah. And, met, and him, met him yeah. face to face. This face guy. to face, yeah. See, that's the intriguing part yeah, for me, is because when we say, oh, you got scammed out of 100 grand, you would yeah. imagine that it's one of those random messages, those, yeah. that spam yes. that you get where, yeah. you know, oh, I need help for this, that and the other. Yeah. But you actually met this person I actually met face him, to yeah, face. face to face, yeah. And yeah. what was that like? Talk us through that experience. Uh, it was did he bit... look like his picture? Yeah, he did, actually, yeah. Right. He okay. looked like his picture. So I remember saying, touching him, saying, you are actually real, because, you know, you just don't well, know. Well, I suppose... I remember mom, when know. my mum started using those apps, yeah. I'm like, are they real, do you know? And yeah, I'd be, like, it's... on standby, waiting for her when she'd been yeah. on a date, finding out... Because if... there's some crazy people on exactly there. and that. Some people that put pictures on 25 years older or younger, and they just completely not like it. So, yeah, it's completely... Just like his picture. And I suppose that's probably the worst that you thought it could be. Yeah. Like, I might get there yeah. and it might sort of yeah. be or you that might catfish not moment where it's not yeah. the person that yeah. you thought it could yeah. be. But exactly. I think that, that's something that's really going to raise people's eyebrows yeah. when, uh, well, now that they're watching mm -hmm. and, yeah. and, and they, they start talking about this story with their friends, is that you met this guy. Yeah. This isn't a yeah. digital no. scam. This, this isn't is what it says scam. on, on, you know, if you do not send money to people you don't meet. And also people that you do meet. Yeah. You know, you yes. get to meet that one else. I mean, so, yeah. So what happens that day? So you meet up, what do you do? You go for dinner? Went for dinner at the local pub. Mm -hmm. uh, talked for quite a while. Went home. And then the next day, he asked to meet up again. Yes, in Pargates. It's a local sort of nice place to walk and that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Met up the next day. We, we must have talked at the front for about six or seven hours. But I could talk to him. The conversation just flowed. Mm -hmm. There was no sat at least, you know, you didn't know what to talk about. It just flowed. So mm -hmm. I just felt, I just felt like I'd known him. So you have a couple of nice yeah. dates. You've been mm. talking now for a few weeks. Yeah. Feel relaxed in his company. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Properly relaxed. Proper. proper so relaxed, when yeah. does the sort of can you send me money conversation it, begin? That doesn't. I, it was me that offered him money. And how and how does yeah. that look? How did that happen? Uh, right. Uh, he was working abroad. Mm -hmm. uh, it, something important, he couldn't really discuss it. So, anyway, and then his dad died, suddenly. So he asked me to come to Dubai with him. So I went over to Dubai. Uh... And once again, you met him there? No, I right. didn't meet him there. There was someone else that met me. Unfortunately, he couldn't make her. So I was like, oh, four days in Dubai now. Anyway, uh, he wanted me to do the things that he was meant to do, look at... go through his dad's will, sort out all that, sign it. You know, he trusted me to do that, so I was quite like, oh, he, he trusts me to do that. And how so. long had it been at that point? Uh, maybe six, seven months. OK. Yeah, six, okay. seven months of talking. Did you, at the time, did you... Well, I suppose not. Did you find any of that a little bit odd, that he didn't... He couldn't make it to Dubai? No, because or... I, I've got a friend that her, her... Someone she knows worked for some agency, I can't... Uh, and he said, that, that, that can happen. They're not even allowed to tell the wives what part of the country... Right. Going to. So I, I, I thought, well, yeah, that's quite normal. Even mm -hmm. though I've not come across it, I thought, yeah, well, my friend has said that 
someone had worked for some secret agency, right. but they couldn't even tell the family where they were going. So I thought, oh, right, OK, so that's normal. I did think it was a bit strange. But yeah, going all we'll that just... way and then, not, and then all of a sudden mm -hmm. saying, oh, I'm not coming, you're going to yeah. make a friend. That's yeah, I know, I know, but I think I'd been hooked in by then. Right. I, yeah. I, you know, and I was, yeah. So you well, were 100%... in love with him. Yeah, crazy, mm -hmm. isn't it? Mm -hmm. But, yeah, I was, yeah. Well, we all do funny yeah. things when we're in love, and yeah. if you are in love with yeah. someone, you will do anything for them. Yeah. But finding an emotional connection as well, that's the key, isn't it? So you, <laughs> I think looking back, we can see what he's done. He's oh, hooked he, you in with the emotion. Manipulation with the... at its highest level, you just couldn't believe it. So yeah. you, you obviously, that first time, you offered. So you offered to, yeah. to help him with money. And how, I... how much was that the first time you said £10,000. But what he'd made me, he asked me to look after a document mm -hmm. and I put it in my passport, put it in my bag. This document had to come off. It's a money laundering document. I can't remember exactly. It had gone. So I was like, oh, dear. OK. Right, you know the trouble you're going to cause us. Uh, this is going, oh, it's, this is all for nothing. Uh, how much does it cost to replace it? £10,000, we haven't got it and all this. And I'm like, it's my fault. Yeah, I'll pay for it. Right. So he's, yeah. he's, he's, he's already, emotionally... Yeah, yeah, he's already worked out the sort of person yeah. I am. And I felt so bad. I thought, oh, dear, no, 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 you can't pay for it, no, no. That went on for a while. And he said, right, we'll take you up on your offer. OK. Yeah. So that's yeah. the £10,000. Yeah. How do we get from £10,000 to £100,000? Yeah, bizarrely. It's uh, because when the money come over, it, because it, it needed to be changed from dollars to English money, it was kept in a vault, which you had to pay weekly, uh, monthly, to keep it there. It was there for a long time. Right. Yeah, so that's that's the the reason for the money. So this yeah. is so this is your relationship. Uh, hang on, sorry, Rosh, mm -hmm. sorry, I apologize. Yeah. Say that Go again. Ahead. I don't understand that bit. Say that again. So you give him 10 mm -hmm. and then 20, and then he said... No, I'll give him £10,000. Right. That was to pay for it. Apparently a certificate. The document, yeah. yeah. A document, lost. right? Yeah. So that was all sorted. That, when, when it was brought over, uh, the money to England, yeah. because it hadn't been transferred from dollars to English money, right. it, had to be, it had to be kept there in some sort of vault. This is what this I was is told. What she's okay. been this is what I was right. being told. And then there's and interest had to in keeping it. Oh yeah, the and, and there's problems. Right. It, it, it just all. It, it just okay. So so this is this is John. We have as we yeah. said before, John, John is his yeah, real yeah. name. So this yeah. is John. This is yeah. the situation. And then you meet his friend. Yeah, Doug. Doug. Doug was the person I met in Dubai was Philip. But apparently John had said to me, he's messing up. He's not doing it right. He's not following. I'm getting rid of him. I'm going to introduce Doug, he, you can trust him, he'll sort it out, he'll take care of you, make sure you're all right, because I was so stressed at that time. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, meet Doug. Yeah, introduce me as Doug. He's going to sort all this out and get it all sorted, so you don't need to worry no more, you'll get your money back. And then you started a digital relationship with him, is that right? I met him. On met a oh, you met him as well? I met him, come to London. OK. Every week, met him, yeah, right. met him. In the process, I'd fallen out with, uh, with Don. You know, right. but and so he... now you're now dating Doug? No, I, I didn't date Doug. I was just meeting Doug to try and sort, work, work, work out this money to, you know, how we're going to get sorted mm -hmm. so I could get my money back and it can all be sorted. That was my main focus, cos I'd, I'd loan money off my friends. Mm -hmm. That was more important for me to, you know, get my, my friends' money mm -hmm. back. Uh, and it was just a process. I think because I'd fallen out with John because of everything that was going yeah, on. Yeah, well, of course. And it was just, it was just, yeah. So, so then how, how did you, what, at what point did you realise, hang on, I'm getting fleeced here, they're taking me money yeah, off me. And then at uh, what point did you call the police? The police come, uh, the day before I come to London, the last time I gave him money, and said, oh, we believe uh, you're being scammed. No, I don't believe so. Right, you, you, you get on the phone now and tell him the police are here, they believe you're being scammed, you won't hear from him again. So I did, and he said, Lynn, don't worry, they're doing the job. Do not worry, I, I've got nothing to worry about. So I was like, I, that, mm -hmm. that's not the case, is it? Mm -hmm. So I was sort of... Uh, at the turn, you are. Actually. I was actually in such a state, when I look back now, I don't actually know what was going through my head. Yeah. yeah. But well, then the next day, he phoned me when he was meant to be in Israel and it came up United Kingdom. So I was right, right. This is it. And that's then it. you worked with the police <laughs> yeah, to get Yeah, I went to the police and said, right, we need to do something. Mm -hmm. So we set, set up a sting. So I had to speak to him for about three months, all of them, knowing what I did, because right. I thought, I'm going to get you. And you yeah. did in the end? Yeah, yeah, it, yeah, set up. And, and Doug was arrested? Yeah, he was arrested. He got... They, they've not caught... There was, there was a 
maybe 10, 15 people mm -hmm. altogether that I met. Right. Doug Goodness was the only me. person that was arrested. He got three years, 12 months, I think. And then, John, the initial yeah, contact that you he's made, never, he's, he's never, still no, out there. He's, that, he's still at large. This, you... this is just so horrible that you've had to go through this. Yeah. And, yes, you know, one of them have been convicted, yeah. but it's just not OK that this is... This happens it's horrible. If you horrible. had any advice for somebody now dating online, but hearing this story and thinking, hang on a minute, this is all sounding a little bit too close, yeah. what would your advice My, be? Uh, dating online, I would... Red flags, look out for the red flags. I never knew any red flags, never. If someone asks you to go to Hangouts or anything else, it's a red flag, email. Yeah, meet, meet the person. Mm -hmm. If they make excuses, mm -hmm. I, you know, I, I just wouldn't go online dating, to be honest. There's so there's so much uh, there's so many scammers on there. I just say, it, you know, keep your family involved. Always, I was segregated from my, but he met, he, he chose that, so everything yeah. was just between me and him. So it got it got to the stage where it was just, yeah, listen the family to didn't those know. red flags. Yeah, right? listen to them red flags if something's too good to be true. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Well, yeah, I'm happy enough. because I know that you have found love since. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's exactly what we want. Look at the smile on your face. Yeah, yeah. 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 This <laughs> door, yeah. So I'm pleased about that. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, and thank I think you. Thank you very much. This, yeah. you, you will help so many yeah. people. So thank yeah, you. Yeah, I so hope much. so. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. yeah.